so that my uh, <clears throat> my batteries shut off on me, so I had to restart the video. So, um, okay, so what I'm going to show you now is I'm going to show you things that do matter, but that matter off-site. So this is what I do for myself. This is what I do for clients, um, and this is kind of the method behind it. So again, like, like I've said it a couple times, um, Google cares more about what external websites have to say about your site than what your site actually says itself. So you can say that you're a Palm Desert plumber all day long twice on Sunday and if you've got it 7,000 times on your website, Google doesn't care as much as if 7,000 websites outside of your site have a link to your site that tells Google and its algorithm that you are a Palm Desert plumber. Okay, so what we're doing here is is we're what we do is we build links. Okay, so as you're cruising around the internet, um, or uh, you know, if you want to build your ranking, the best thing you can do is get links back to your site from um, back to your website from other places. So you know, there's online directories. There are uh, review sites like you know Yelp. Um, there's Yelp. This kind of also ties into online directories. There's Yelp. There's City Search. There's Merchant Circle, which is more of like a um, social network for businesses, but it's also a directory. So there's a bunch of sites out there. Now, these will all give you links back to your website. There's social media. So social media, which is, you know, Facebook, Twitter, Google+. Um, Yelp has a you know a social concern, uh, component to it. Um, social media, so these all these all allow you to build links. Now the, the the problem with these are is most of them just give you a standard link. So you'll get a www.pdplumber.com. I'm just making that up. I'm sure that domain name belongs to somebody. So, but I don't know who they are. So, let's just say that this is your website. Any links that you build from social media, a review site, online directories, or anywhere where you just go in and punch in your domain name, this is how it's going to display. So that doesn't really do you any, that doesn't give you much SEO value, although it does tell um, Google that you're in a, somewhat, you're more authoritative than if you had none of these links, okay? So what we want to do is we want to get links that link back to your pdplumber.com website, but we want to use what's called anchor text. So you know, when you're on a website, you'll see a link where it'll be, um, uh, let, me, let me switch over to blue here. So we've got text written on a website. And then you'll have a link that'll say, you know, uh, Palm Desert. Alright, so you'll have black text, and then you'll have Palm Desert Plumber, and then you'll have, have more text, and this is set up with a link. So if you click on this, ideally, <clears throat> or what will happen is typically is it'll take you to it'll take you to another website. It'll open up a new window. Alright? What well, this text right there, where it says Palm Desert Plumber, that's anchor text. So Palm Desert Plumber in this instance is your anchor text. So if your website is PD Real Estate Agent or Palm Desert Real Estate Agent.com, you would want your anchor text pointing back to your site to be Palm Desert Real Estate or Realtor or whatever your keywords are that you're going to go after, okay? So that's your anchor text. Everything that's in this little box, okay? Um, now again, if you're using a, a uh, an editor online that's part of the website that lets you kind of edit the HTML as you as you add the text, if it lets you put pictures in, if it lets you add links and stuff like that, ideally you you want to be able to do this this way. Some of them strip it out, so you're not going to be able to win all those battles. Some of them will strip this link out. Um, let me show you how, like. Um, uh, Craigslist, for example. Craigslist will let you do, I think right now they'll let you do one link in your description. So, but you've got to code it in. And there's other sites out there like that, like um, 
e-zine articles, stuff like that. You can put links in. You're limited to how many you can put. But this is how the code goes, all right? So if our uh, website, if our website is www.pdplumber.com, and our keyword, our anchor text we want to use, is going to be uh, Palm Desert Plumber. <clears throat> this is how the code goes, okay? So if you've just got a text editor like Craigslist, or they don't give you an option to, uh, to insert a link, then this is how you type this in, all right, to build some SEO value for yourself, all right? So... This is the code. So what you'll do is you'll have text, 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 where you want to insert your link, and then more text, okay? So this is the code. It's, it's going to be um, this bracket, lowercase a. You want to do a space, lowercase h, r, e, f, the equal sign, quotes, your uh, URL with HTTP, forward slash forward slash in front of it, okay? So, http colon forward slash forward slash www dot pd plumber dot com Alright, and then you're done with this, this link now, so you close it with two more quotes, alright? And then you close that bracket again, all right? So I'm running out of space here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to continue with this on the next line, but this should all be smushed together, okay? So starting right here, this is where you would put your keyword, all right? So your keyword or your anchor text. So in there, we would put Palm Desert Plumber right here, okay? Now after that, so we're going to do Palm Desert Plumber. Right, let me delete this. Palm Desert Plumber. And then what you're going to do is you're going to refer back to this. It doesn't really matter why or, or, or whatnot, but I want you to see how it, how it looks. So you do another bracket, a forward slash, lower class A, or lowercase a, and then boom, and then you'll continue with your text. Okay? Now what that'll do for you is when you go to save, it's going to, if the program lets you do it, and if you have this typed in correctly, okay, if you have this typed in correctly, it'll give you, it'll give you your Palm Desert Plumber. It'll give you your link back to your site. Okay, so that's one way that you can help build SEO value when you're doing stuff or if you're running ads on Craigslist, if you're, you know, if you're commenting on forums or, or just, you know, just cruising around the internet, finding where you can contribute or add content. Now, this, this system does not work on Facebook. It doesn't work on Twitter. Um, none of that. All those social media sites just give you a link back to your site, so you have to just give them that. They'll give you a link, but you're not going to be able to use Anchor Text or, or, or any of that for that, okay? So um, I'll put a link. I'll, I'll put some of this in the description of the video, okay, so that you guys can kind of cut and paste how that goes, all right?